Digging Deep with OG Mark Gray. Every year, the mythic romance of the Negro League lives on through places like the Negro League Baseball Hall of Fame. However, when you get a chance to watch the few, the proud, the remaining bros get their shine, well, you just got to sit back and soak it in. So what's the deal? This the MLB OG Mark Gray, and we get knowledge from several legendary Negro League bros who you may not know while I'm going deep for the mixtape. Camden Yards in Baltimore holds a unique place in baseball history because of how it changed the look of venues around the league back in 1992. But earlier this season, the Orioles gave props to several living Negro League players who changed the game long before then. Sam Allen split three years between the Kansas City Monarchs and the Memphis Red Sox between 1957 and 1959 before he was called to serve in the U.S. Army. While there was no celebration when he finished his time in the military, to get his flowers at the yards meant the world to him. Better late than never. It's always good to be honored. Why are you living? Pedro Sierra was part of the Afro-Latino invasion that has taken over the show. He played for the Indianapolis Clowns and Detroit Stars between 1954 and 1958 before a long minor league career in the Washington Senators and Minnesota Twins organization. He, too, is glad that the Negro Leagues are finally getting their props. Well, this is something very special because the way people recognize, you know, who we were, what we did. With time passing, both Allen and Sierra can now look back and see how the game is being played today, which is a lot like the way they did it back in the day. Well, we made a big impact on the game of baseball because uh, we did a lot of it. We did a lot to the game. Major League Baseball now has shown its respect for the glory days when the players played for the love of the game as they host the first Negro League Classic in Birmingham this June. As always, I'm the MLB OG Mark Gray, and I'm going deep for the mixtape.